I saw this video of this very man of God. I must tell you that this man of God is genuine. What the issue they mouth like? This pastor will make heaven seven times. Go the go the con the go the con the go the con the way like. Nobody go disturb her for heaven. What are you telling me? If I stand to propose to you as my girlfriend, you not take. I can sit down, propose. You say you not take. So I must need down. I will never ever propose to you. Because I cannot go against the word of God. I cannot. I obey the word of God with my life. This man of God opened my eye. When I commit sin any, I'm gonna go need down. They propose, give on a guess in a romantic. You people are committed. Repent, no fire will burn you. It was from scripture that I saw that kneeling down to propose was satanic. Most people think it's romantic. Go into the house and propose. Either I find it, the wife find it, good thing, or find it. What are you bringing to a social media for? Most everything be on social media. People now kneel down to propose. How can the Lord kneel down to propose a subject? It's like they say they want to ordain the king of this country, but they say the king will lie down. The Lord over the woman is now kneeling down to propose to the woman, and tomorrow he wants to be Lord over her. It doesn't work. What we think is romantic is Satan orchestrating our downfall. Marriages are failing because women are not thinking men are not romantic. But please, can you show me anywhere in the scripture, this romance that we talk now, that we read, anybody in the entire scripture, including Jesus, who was romantic? Sarah called Abraham Lord. Was that romantic? My Lord. It was not. The proverb 31 woman is not the one who lies down on the man's head. He's the one who watches over the house while the man is doing the work of God outside. All this we have been saying since. It's, it's, it's satanical. He said we shouldn't add to the truth nor subtract from the truth. Let's, let's put the uh, spade in spade. All this nonsense. That's why women are thinking that marriage is purpose. Discover purpose so that when you marry, purpose will align. You don't have where you are going. That's why you are looking for romance. Because if you have purpose and I have purpose and we are both running with purpose, you will discover that we are fulfilling destiny and you will not be looking for romance. Don't try it again. Better fire than go roast your own son. I don't think it's good to hear my head today. Oh, boy, boy, like it. Oh, see me like it, okay? No, me, me, talk about it. No, me, me, see me, boy, it's not in the day, the proposed one, and this fast up. Now, he's going to go find out of him, yo. But truly, this man of God is preaching the word of God. Boys, are you with me? If you know you are with me, copy this link and share to your fellow boys. Girls, if you know this thing is true, copy the link and share to your fellow girls. It is high time we stand and propose. Don't kneel down. You are a king. You are the Lord of God. Don't kneel down, Pastor. I wish I know your church has spoken you tight. You've done well, sir. God bless you. Share this video. Let the world see. Shut my the mumu. We know they need down the propose. We will sit down or stand. If you not take, you go. <laughs> it was from scripture that I saw that kneeling down to propose was satanic. Most people think it's romantic. Go into the house and propose. Either find it the wife, find it a good thing, and find it for What are you bringing to social media for? Most everything be on social media. People now kneel down to propose. How can the Lord kneel down to propose a subject? It's like they say they want to ordain the king of this country, but they say the king will lie down. The Lord over the woman is now kneeling down to propose to the woman, and tomorrow he wants to be Lord over her. It doesn't work. What we think is romantic is Satan orchestrating our downfall. Marriages are failing because women are not thinking men are not romantic. But please, can you show me anywhere in the scripture, this romance that we talk now, that we read, anybody in the entire scripture, including Jesus, who was romantic? Sarah called Abraham Lord. Was that romantic? My Lord. It was not. The proverb 31 woman is not the one who lies down on the man's head. Is the one who watches over the house while the man is doing the work of God outside. All this we have been saying. See, it's all this is satanical. He said we shouldn't add to the truth nor subtract from the truth. Let's let's put the uh, spade in spade. All this nonsense. That's why women are thinking that marriage is purpose. Discover purpose so that when you marry, purpose will align. You don't have where you are going. That's why you are looking for romance. Because if you have purpose and I have purpose and we are both running with purpose, you will discover that we are fulfilling destiny, and you will not be looking for romance. Don't try it again.